Welcome to our how to series of videos. In this episode, we are looking at how to take a sharp corner. As you can see from the ground conditions, we have loose rocks to contend with, as well as having to approach the corner whilst descending the path. So what factors do we need to take into account when tackling this? Communication, speed, and control, or CSC. Communication. When doing canicross, it is very much a partnership between you and your dog. You will need to communicate to your dog to let them know what you are expecting them to do. Speed. Going down a descent like this, there is a danger your speed will increase, causing you to overshoot your turning. Saying something like steady to calm your dog so it's not trying to run flat out. Control. So using communication and speed, you can control the situation. As you approach the corner, you want to be letting your dog know that they need to be ready to turn. Just before you hit the turning, you need to be telling your dog to turn right. That gives them time to understand what's expected and for them to see the turning. Leave it too late and they will overshoot. Here we have Kona and Helen approaching the corner. As you can see, they are keeping the line nice and tight as they go around. And they're having to pick their route very carefully as they go down the descent. So if we slow this down a little bit, we can see how they are staying to the middle of the track where it's a little bit smoother. You can also see as they're descending how Helen is leaning back and also using her arms to help her balance as they go down the hill. Helen is constantly communicating with Kona to let her know what she wants her to do by getting her to go at a nice steady speed and then telling her to turn right. And the end result, a perfectly timed sharp corner going right into the woods. So we hope you liked our first how-to episode. If there's anything else that you'd like us to cover, please pop it in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.